Yo, 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 what they do? Welcome to another episode of NBL. It's your boy, Corn and my brother, Easy E. Talk to him, bro. You already know, you already know. We back in this bitch with another episode. Back to give y'all some more news, some hot topics, and some questions and some debates, man. So fuck with us. Yeah, man, fuck with us, man. The first, the first um topic we got for y'all today is, ooh, did y'all see that Kyrie finish? Kyrie finished mm-hmm. with the left sky hook over. Nah, over that shit was Joker. nasty. Over that shit Joker was nasty. To win. Kleba looking in for Irving. Irving for the win. Oh my god! A self pump finish from Kyrie Irving. That's nasty. Shooting that three though to be Detroit, but it's all good. But nah, <laughs> Kyrie, man, Kyrie, that was nasty what Kyrie did, man. Kyrie, I gotta check Kyrie's stats, man, because he for him to do that, he, he don't need those stats. He won the game. That's he only all he needed was like 14. Hey, listen, he don't need no points. I ain't he won a fucking game. It don't matter. I feel like I feel like Kyrie needed something like that, like to like re up his name because I look, a lot of people forgot how good Kyrie is and how much that boy like skilled, you feel me? Cause, you know, sometimes you got to remind a nigga. You got to go back in the bag sometimes. You feel me? I'm about to go back in the bag. You, know like... you know what? You're right. But you know what? Luca, re- you know, Luca respect him. Because Luca ain't respect nobody on that team before he came there. Luca respect yeah. Kyrie. Kyrie ain't got to do shit. Why would he? Luka respect him. Because he was garbage. Yeah. <laughs> nah, yeah. but you know, they had the, they not, they had Buddy that went to the Knicks. That's no. balling right no, now. No, I'm going to be real. I was just going to say, Jalen Brunson, he was good. Luca he- ain't respect him. No, he didn't. But listen, he was he, he was he was coming on. Luke ain't give him Luke ain't give him a chance to grow until him to himself. Now that boy went to the Knicks, he was able to grow, and now that boy just getting better and better and better. Like that boy still ain't still ain't finished yet. That boy still got some growing to do. What that boy that boy wrong. Hey, hey, so so look, Paul, you say he still got some growing to do. <laughs> but look, man, Pause. hey, nah, for real though, you so you feel like you feel like they should have kept him there since you saying that. I mean, they would have had him on a cheaper deal. When I mean, we could we could do hypotheticals all day, if ands, what, so whatever. But you know, sometimes that's just how the NBA works. Sometimes you trade a player, he get better. Sometimes they move to a different team and they get better. You know, that's just the way shit goes. So I can't sit here and say they should have kept him because you never know. It. Maybe he wouldn't have been that good. So maybe Luca wouldn't have gave him a chance to. You feel me? So maybe he needed okay. to go on his own team and so he, he could control the ball. You feel me? Yeah, nah, I ain't gonna lie. I felt like I, I would have liked to see him over there instead of Kyrie, man. I want to Kyrie to come to the Heat. <laughs> That's why I'm saying that shit. I want to Kyrie to come to Miami. Shit, fuck yeah, Kyrie, man. You know? I I wanted that shit too, though. But you know they be hating on the Heat, dog. Like they the league, the, the league and the, and the other owners, they really be hating on the Heat, bro. When they try to make trades and big, I don't know what. Hey, man, what they, they did? What did he did to people though? What did he do? Well, it's Pat Riley, bro. Listen. Pat Riley don't fuck with them niggas, man. Pat Riley don't fuck with all them. I don't, I don't fuck with them. He, he they cause, cause he's a godfather, bro, and they don't like that shit. Like Pat, they basically feel like, oh, everything got to go through Pat Riley, or if Pat Riley don't okay, like you know how that shit be. So everybody, you know how like you come, you got a job, right? Say y'all at the job, and you got one dude that like he get all the clout, he get all the recognition, all of this and that. So everybody else kind of yeah. like. I don't fuck with Buddy. Buddy ain't all it. Buddy ain't all that. Like that's kind of how they do with the with the, with the, the owner, dude, okay. Pat Riley. Cause our owner, no, we the man. Our owner, listen. Our owner gives Pat Riley all the power, and all the other owners don't do that. Okay. Other than Mark, Cuban. I got you. He, hey, he so man. he basically stay out the way. He stay out the way, like um, like what's his name there for Bill Belichick. Exactly. Like, he he got the way for Bill Belichick. Mm-hmm. But nah, but but I wish um I wish we got Kyrie, but like you said, they got a bad list on us because we couldn't get fucking um what's his name Damian, fucking Kyrie, yeah, Damian Lillard, um Donovan Mitchell, Bradley Donovan Bill, Mitchell. and all those players wanted to come to the Heat, but it's like One something always happened. Daddy took on. Yeah, something always happened and make it don't happen, bro. And it ain't the Heat because yeah. he be ready to get the Heat be ready to get that shit up, like for real. But they always hate. <laughs> hey, 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 yeah, we got, nah, man, I'm laughing because when we, when we watch this shit again, we gonna, you gonna see that and say we wanted badly to come, and them boys want to get that shit up. <laughs> <You don't laughs> <hear that. laughs> nah, you feel me? But it, it's all good, dog. Yeah, yeah, you feel yeah, it's all good. Hey, shout out to Bam too, my dog. Hit a game winner too, now. Like right. game at one on one, four seconds, three. Get it off. Bam for three. Yes. Bam wins the game with a three. 
Yeah, man. Like, Shout out to Bam. Let's get Bam some motherfucker. Yeah, man. Come listen. You feel me? My dog finally shooting threes, man. He been shooting a bitch from the top of the key, but he burnt one a day though. I'm talking about from deep, like gang when the buzzer beat it. Like, yeah, look at that. Yeah, that that, that that's, that's nice right there. Hey, Bam, Bam had a double double on the ass, twenty and seventeen, man. That's what I'm talking about. I want that. From, I need that from Bam. Every hey, night, somebody, man. somebody in the comments say, "Ooh, and I needed Bam to hit twenty. He hit that three, and so basically he covered the points." And um, that's crazy. Hey, cause he ain't McKean covered the last fucking um. I told you I took the man the last couple of games. He ain't covered the last three, probably last four, five games. Yeah, we, we not gonna put in? we not we not gonna put Bam on the ban list. We, we'll let him slide. This I time mean, no, nah, cause he just covered. Yeah, he just covered, so I can't. And then you know, talking about speaking of, speaking of, speaking of scoring, right? Yeah. What you think about okay, like late game scoring? Okay, like say like the teams the game over, like this team up, team A up eighty seven. And team B got let's say seventy nine, so basically it's like um, like fifty seconds left, and so you know how they run out the clock, you know out, out of respect and game over. The timeline, and let time expire, and he picks up his dribble. Butler comes over, they start shaking hands. Watch, shake hands. Hey, good going, man. A lot of people do that shit. You can't get mad. It's your job to stop him. Exactly, bro. Yeah, they, they fought that they beat y'all ass. What they supposed to stop playing? <laughs> Nigga be getting mad, prime dog. Prime example, prime example, prime example. This is just like my son when they playing the game. You know when they get up like by twenty points, they can't they can't press them for a court no more. So they can't press them for a court. They gotta play half court defense. Yeah. And when they shoot a shot, they can't get no more rebounds. They got when they shoot a shot, they just gotta run to the other side. I said, I said what? The ref was like, yeah, because one of the kids touched the rebound. I got um a rebound. Tried to put it back up. She gave him a tech. And we That's got crazy. two shots. I said, I said, That's what kind that of baby rule is that? Shit, yeah, come on. What kind of baby and shit? It's not, hey, if they beating our ass, let them beat our ass. Yeah. Huh? Get baby through this shit. Beat our ass. Show, that, that's going to make me, that's going to make make a beast out of a nigga. Baby. It was, it, like, come on. Because it was a college game where the team, the nigga had a skull and did, he did like a crazy dunk. So the other dude ran down and bumped with the shoulder. Then the other dude threw the ball at him. Man, that's just. Three is off. Luke Ward grabs the rebound. Moore's ahead of everybody. Moore with the flush to finish it. Oh, and now the ball was just thrown. I'm like, these boys wildin', man. Y'all stop the man. Look at y'all getting beat. Just stop them. Out of fighting all that crazy shit. Niggas, niggas be want other niggas to be sportsmen. Like, come on, man. How you want me to be? Nigga, I don't know you. I might have the fun, balling. I'm, I'm feeling good. I ain't got no sportsmanship. Remember, like, like it's just like the hurricanes back in the days, bro. When them boys used to score and shit, and then they be dancing and doing all type of flips and dancing all in the end zone. <laughs> Get mad and talk about some. Oh, they shouldn't be dancing. Oh, they shouldn't be doing all that. That's unsportsman. Like, well, I'm like, y'all gotta stop us. Like, stop the boy from scoring. And they won't be dancing and shit. You feel me, bro, bro? All that, I, all the people that said that was mad that the, that they was winning. <laughs> that, that's all that was. It's always the person on the opposite side, on the opposite side that, that's losing that got something to say. Not the person that's winning. Let the if the winners feel like, hey man, we don't need to be doing this. That's cool. But the losers should not have an opinion on what the fuck we doing over here. That's what we want. If we, if we want to do the cry baby or the worm or whatever we want to do, but let us do stop it. us. Stop, stop us. Stop us. Like, straight up. <laughs> That's crazy. God damn. Um, on another sports level, the um, NFL. Your boy, what his name is? Um, Aaron Donald. But yeah. I'm tired, man. I but I hung it up. I but on what ten years? He been in the lead. Ten. Uh, yeah, ten years. Yeah, that's what you think about Aaron Donald retiring. What you think about his career? I, I ain't gonna lie. Aaron Donald had a hell of a career. Aaron Donald really need a he, he needed he need I feel like he he needed that this break. I mean not this break, but his retirement because he put a lot he put a lot into that team, dog. You think about it. And right now they're going through a rebuilding stage and he ain't, that's wasted his in his career too. So yeah. I feel like it was it was well needed for him. I would like to see him go to the Cowboys, but and I feel I like always, Feel like yeah, man, we'll go to the Cowboys. Yeah, go and ahead, them, and and them players don't be playing that long no more. Like players that be going through like running backs and DN and all that like that, that do a lot of hitting and contact. They don't be playing that long no more. Cause 
that shit well on you after football. And I feel like them boys be taking that CTE shit into consideration. So they be like thinking about that shit too. And like, I done made enough bread, I done did my thing, time to move on type shit. You feel me? Nah, for real. And and the bread that they making is crazy. You feel me? So they definitely like they could retire <laughs> early, bro. And then you, you like Terry Aaron Donald. Remember he got that the last contract he got was I got his I, I got his what it was, Aaron Donald stats. He played 10 years. He, uh-huh. That's 543 games he played. He had 111 uh-huh. sacks and okay. 203 tackles um, combined. So that boy did his thing. Because the 111 sacks, boy, that's a lot. <laughs> that's a, and look, he ain't play on the end. He Hold on. He was a tackle. And then this man used to get triple team. Like, look at this shit, bro. You got three people on this man. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. He used to get double team, the triple team. Like triple, I was talking about triple team. But anybody team. that played with Aaron Donald, I see why he was letting niggas go. I, when Von Miller got there, that, then, then Von, Von Miller got off because that nigga get double team. So whoever exactly. on the end should be getting the fuck off. So them niggas die. I don't know. Them niggas that was with him this year, them niggas were sorry because they wasn't getting off. Shout out to Aaron Donald. Take a, take a sip for Aaron Donald. Take a shot. I'm trying so for that I boy. Got to take, I got some water. <laughs> Yeah, what I got take, <laughs> take a drink with my dog, from my dog, man. Yeah, yeah. What you got, bro? Uh, what, what? What you got on the stove cooking right now? What's on, what's on the stove? Hey, um, the stand, the stand sports too. Um, they gave Isaiah Thomas. A, I I, think, I I like this story. They gave Isaiah Thomas another shot with the sun. Oh, a ten, a ten day. day contract. Yeah, I like that because I ain't gonna lie. On, I ain't like how he was. How he got put out of the league because he got hurt, man. He was really he was a good player. For Boston yeah, no. And I don't like Boston, but I ain't gonna lie, I kind of liked Isaiah because he was he was a good they, story. He was about to get that big contract. They did Isaiah dirty as fuck, boy. That's one story. I feel like they did him dirty. I ain't yeah, they did him dirty. Story. He was on the verge then, of get I, big contract. They, Kyrie came in. They wanted him getting Kyrie around that time. Let me tell them the story about Isaiah Thomas right quick. Isaiah Thomas he used to play for Boston Celtics. And he used to ball out. I'm talking about straight ball in the regular season playoffs. Like, short as hell. Little ass nigga balling. So, he was finna get a big contract the next season. But he ended up hurting his knee. And basically, everything went down from that. He never got no big contract. He ended up getting traded. Then he ended up out the lead. Then he ended up cross seas for some playing in the big three. Like, he been doing all type of shit. But they finally gave him a 10-day contract with um, Phoenix Sun. So, maybe he could resurrect his career. I hope so. And they man, they could have been dead that for him, dog. That <laughs> man, come on, man. That man, that man, a good ass, um, a hard worker. He's a he's a hell of a player. I feel like so they could have did that for him. That's the least. Boston they had to give him the biggest contract, but they could gave him something. Even y'all, we heard, we ain't gonna give you this hundred mil. We gonna give you forty, fifty. They could have did that for him. You feel me? But that's yeah, crazy. Yeah. But I ain't gonna lie, bro. It's hey, it take a lot for you to still be balling because that was years ago, and this man ain't give up. So he he got that he got that he got the ice in his vein because he didn't give up. Well, he could yeah, keep going. Up. Up. Let's keep going. Like that, you said, he went story. overseas. That he boy. went into the big three league. Yeah, that's uh, yeah. a life lesson. Keep going. Just keep going. Keep dog. going. No, and it don't matter. Hey, you miss your. You think feel like you miss your biggest uh, opportunities? Fuck that. Keep going. Keep Might going. have another opportunity. God damn it! Don't stop. Hey. Fuck that shit. <laughs> on a on a funny note, right? This is I seen this shit on Twitter, right? On X or whatever they wanna call it. But I still call it Twitter. X. I seen this shit on Twitter, right? So okay, they got this little ice cream shop, right? I wanna I wanna know, would you let your girl go here? They got this ice cream shop, right? And the dudes behind the counter, they make like dick ice cream. Like ice cream with like Nah, dick, she ain't right? gonna Yeah, nah. <laughs> so listen, Sorry, son. Nah. So they, they, they gotta <laughs> go feed ahead. it, they got they gotta feed it to her. And all that. Sometimes they hold it to they like down to they private, and they let them eat it like that. Like, and buddy, and, and like dudes, they really be sitting there, like, why they girl doing that shit and all that shit. Like, I always want to know would you let the girl do that shit? <laughs> Man, no. <laughs> if she do do it, she ain't my girl. <laughs> that sounds like some desperate, some desperate shit. That some some fat girls that do that's, that I can't get. That's no not like some shit females do at a bachelor bachelorette party or some shit. Yeah, like, that's not like some low shit key like that. shit. It, hey. Matter of fact, look, bro. That one of your girl, they had a video of your girl at a bachelorette party with a male stripper. He slinging his, his meat all in her face. She was, what you gonna do? What you what what is what you Wait, doing? No, you come it, on, wait no, it, wait no, wait <laughs> no. Hey, hey, she out nah. 
meat all hitting in the face. I'm nah, saying it's crazy bro. though, cause look, these dudes do. I ain't gonna lie, these niggas be fucking these hoes at a fucking um, bachelorette party. That's crazy. Yeah, that shit be I crazy. I ain't gonna lie, that's some crazy. These hoes be about to get married, man. That's crazy, that's dog. Yeah, that shit be crazy. I hey, stay having script. What, hey, what we do at all though? What the man do? I, I, yeah, it's just the regular shit. Like it's, it's some regular, regular hoes strippers. Regular, we probably get yeah, the like, strippers coming. Mean, yeah, come on now, cause you hey, already nice. know what. Well, this marriage time with any fuck up boy, this shit, boy, this shit over with, boy. So they got, you know what I'm saying? They going, they walking on, they going walking on glass. And then half the time, glass. the dude that's getting married don't even know about no script, but they be the homeboys that playing that shit. You the know what I'm saying? That playing that shit. Yeah, exactly. Hey, you know what? I just thought about something. You right? Every time the dude, every movie or shit we seen, the dude really don't be worried about shit to be honest. Cause you know what his mind be on? All this shit he done paid for. He ain't worried about no fucking bitches. Like, man, I don't, I don't got time right, for no bitches. You got me I fucked up. This shit go wrong. Nigga done paid yeah, all his money. Yeah, man, I got me <laughs> fucked up. I'm not, I'm not worried about these hoes. I got bills. I got bills. I got still got to pay for this shit. I got. I probably got about eight, um, fifty eight months to go on this shit. The payments plan. Um, you can say fifty eight. Uh, I'm on the car. I'm on the Carolina. I'm on the firm. I got the rest firm. of my life to pay for this I'm shit. <laughs> hey, you heard me? But well, they got a firm. They got a firm, Kyle Lala, hey. and a firm got a plan for you to pay uh pay off your way. That's so crazy. Trying to, for people that niggas got on my head, boy, got a, I, I got I got my I got my my, my own way and the layaway and shit, y'all niggas. <laughs> nah, hey, bro, but listen, I got with you that don't... too. With that too, you know what? What's the tradition? What they say the tradition is like traditionally. What the man don't put the paper away, really. What they say how it go? What? Remember they say. Um, all right, you receiving a, Tell me a man, like her dad, her dad put the paper. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's how I supposed to be. I in heard the old that. Day. That was the tradition. Yeah, in the old day, the dad, the dad was to pay for it and give her and give her away. Because he giving her away. Yeah. I need I that to come back, boy. Yeah, what, that. That what is that? Hey, niggas, if you getting married tomorrow, if that was the case. I'm telling you. Yeah. Hey, I'll be, I'll, shit, I'll be picking hey, what you want to wear. Shit, whatever y'all want, man. Y'all paying for it. Shit, I don't give a damn. <laughs> I'm ready to party at this point. At that point, I'm gonna be into the strippers at the bachelorette party. <laughs> I'm gonna be, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be hey, you know up, them, boy. Hey, what them parties the the Jewish people be having the little bar mix for shit when they come oh, and everybody they get up in the money. Chair? Yeah, and everybody get them money and gifts and shit, and, that, and that's basically how they be taking off like with their careers and they and they business. I'm trying to see what what is that though when they do that. It's a bar mix I know, but what the bar mitzvah is for? It's not a birthday. What is they turning? They turning the age or they... It's like when they become a man or some shit. Uh, a certain become a man. Age, yeah. Okay. Oh. A certain age. Okay. Yeah. Like, I ain't gonna yeah, lie. Like, them shit's look lit. Yeah, them shit's be lit, boy. Like... They be fucked. They be getting They getting straight up. bread, bro. Like, that's the gifts. Like, straight money. Like... Hey, imagine going home with... Imagine going home with 10 bands from, from um, bar mitzvah. Nigga, like 10 bands. Nigga, like they be getting 100,000. I'm on the light end. Look, I'm on the light. I'm on the nigga <laughs> end right now. I ain't on the I ain't on they end. I'm on the nigga end. You getting yeah, five to ten you. bands. You go, you like, oh man, that's that's love. Thank y'all. They probably getting about 50 to 100 bands. <laughs> that just that just huh, throw that in your savings or some shit like that. That yeah. general what that general wealth right there, man. Generation wealth, my bad. That's, that's crazy. Good. Hey, um, and I want to shout out the some of the um N A M N A A C P award winners. No, 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 it's it's, it's the N C double A. It's the N double A C P. Oh, N double A C P. That was the N A A. N double A C P. I'm about to say N C A A championship. College football. Nah, some of the award winners, man. We had Fantasia. She won the best motion um picture actress or something like that. I think it was for um the color purple. Congratulate her. And to uh, Taraji, you know how to say a bad name better than me. Oh, uh, Taraji P. Henson, that's my baby. Don't get her name. Taraji, she won one for color purple too. And the, our boy um from what's his name? Where you from British? England? Yeah, the Damson oh. Idris or Idris Damson. Idris, he won one for yeah. Snowfall. He won for Snowfall. Now them the the people that we acknowledge, there's way more people who won, but then there's people that just we acknowledge it right now. Shout out to everybody that won something that night. Shout out to everybody that won. But we we acknowledge them, man. We we like I ain't gonna lie, I seen the color purple. It was a good movie. I ain't gonna lie to you. Yeah. But, hey, I seen somebody who who I would have liked to win, but they didn't win in that. Who? Um 
they close Tyrone. Buddy from they close Tyrone. He lost to um, I think it was Idris. No, yeah, 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 he did. I think it was it, it probably went it was probably somebody else, but he lost one of them. I, I like though. I forgot his name. He and he played on Star Wars or something. I forgot his mm-hmm. name. I like him. He I, I like the hey, I ain't gonna lie, I like that they close Tyrone over the color purple. You seen that yeah. movie? No, nah, I ain't never did. Like I ain't never seen it. No, no, no. They close Tyrone, you never seen that either? Oh no, 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 I did, I did. That was um, Remember there was there was in the hood and they were eating the chicken that, and shit. That, that yeah, Jamie Foxx. Yeah, Jamie Foxx. Yeah. All right, all right. I you liked it? it? Yeah, no. yeah, it, yeah, it was I, great. It was great. It was great. It was I fuck with it. It was a look. Hey, it made you kind of think, like, hmm, what are they doing this shit? You feel me? It made you think. That's what it was. And the color purple Listen, to me, that was just another every, roommate, dog. I like they say in every joke, there's some truth. In every movie, there's some truth, man. There's something true about this shit. It ain't, might not all be true, but something true. Trust me. Hey, bro, when the last time you had Popeye chicken? <laughs> Popeye, I had Popeye's probably like about a month ago. How it make you feel when you eat it? You eat, you feel good? I mean, I be I, I be full. <laughs> so I guess I be feeling good. <laughs> I don't be feeling like no superpowers and no crazy shit. Yeah, nah, nah, because you know when they ate the chicken, it started yeah. making them laugh. Like they just had know. Trip, so, so it make you forget shit. Like you just but happy, listen, they you do laugh, put they, listen, they put shit in our food and shit, but they put so like, much shit in that chicken. But, it ain't like that, like the movie, like where you be laughing and shit, but they showing you that they put shit in the food. And that and it's true. All that red 40 and all that shit like that, bad for you. Like, hey shit, you look that you start looking that shit up, you be like, why man, this shit that they put in fucking on uh, weapons. Why the fuck they putting this shit in food? But yeah, um, you know what got the, you know food got the most shit in it? Um Chick-fil-A. Yeah. And I used to love Chick-fil-A, but they got more than they got. The, I don't eat that shit because that shit too high. <laughs> <laughs> bro, every time me and my girls go to Chick fil A, bro, that shit come like $42, bro, every time. Bro, I'm like, yeah. Oh, because y'all get y'all getting a family meal. Y'all getting everything for the door. Oh, because everybody getting their own meal with a milkshake. <laughs> <laughs> that shit be there in the $50, boy. Hey, see, y'all got a budget. Y'all got to go there and be like, let me get um chicken sandwich. Babe, what you get? You get fries or a chicken sandwich because you ain't getting both. <laughs> we pick one. Hey, Take a pick fight. one. And look, then this how you do it. Look, look, one person get the drink, one person get the fry, yeah. one person get the burger, yeah. one person get the nugget, and then we bust that shit down. You feel? And then we, and then we, and then I can get a milkshake, and everybody can take the, you know, get their little. So let me get one milkshake, and let me get four uh, little cups. Damn, yeah, everybody, that's how you do that, man. Or oh, you could be like Chad Johnson. Chad say, man, go to go to McDonald's. Hey, McDonald's expensive too, man. Nah, man. All that shit expensive, not all. All that shit expensive, dog. McDonald's, man, dog. Hey, they ain't got the dollar menu no more. McDonald's, like, I'm spending, listen, Chick-fil-A, I'm spending no less than no less than $35 to $40. And McDonald's, I'm spending no less than $30 to $20 to $20. 20 to 30 saying, every hey, time. All I heard is the same price. <laughs> every time, bro. <laughs> I ain't That's what no I'm saying. Dog. I ain't hear no different. You know what I'm saying, I, bro? This shit. That's why I say cook something, dog. Let's cook. Fuck that. At least we can hey, eat that shit for like two days. That, hey, yeah, you can eat that shit for two days. That cooking <laughs> shit be... Sometimes you want something right there, so we got to go out there and just get what, what we could get, man. Check us. Hey, now you got me thinking. <laughs> Check us, McDonald's, Burger King, Chick-fil-A, whatever, Wendy's. Which one you Which one you like? You like better? You got me thinking about these restaurants. All right. Well, each one got something kind of good about them that make them different. But if I had to rate them in order, oh, okay, it has changed over the years. So I'm going to start with maybe what I like. Okay, Burger King first for me because I love their burgers or what any of the other burgers. Burger King. You like that waffle. Yeah, then I say Wendy's. Then I say McDonald's. Then I say Chick-fil-A and whoever else. But... I don't really like like. Oh, really you like said. Chicken. Well, hold on. You said Burger King. I'm not a chicken fan, so that's probably why I got Chick-fil-A at the bottom. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. You ain't got to put chip if you don't want to. You can take. <laughs> we, could, we were just. But I got Burger at, King. I, I got Burger the... King, Wendy's, uh-huh. McDonald's. Probably. Oh, checkers. Checkers. Put checkers in there. Put checkers in there. Checkers behind Chick-fil-A. I put Chick-fil-A checkers. Okay. All yeah, right. Yeah. That's how I do my five right there. I mean, Burger your five is kind of set up. Mate. Chick-fil-A. My five set up um, checkers. Come first because I love their fries and their milkshake. 
Check That's number one. one. Checkers number one. Yeah, cause I ain't gonna lie, bro. I go to checkers a lot. I actually go. To okay. A lot. That's what's up. I, I just love that banana shake and the fries though, for real. I love that banana shake, bro. This banana shake good. Checkers, uh, Burger King, McDonald's, uh, Chick Chick Fil A, Chick-fil-A and Wendy's. Wendy's. Yeah, I don't really like Wendy's like that. I ain't gonna lie. Even though they got that four for four. Nah, I ain't about the four for four. It's like they they burgers be seeming a little more healthier than that other shit. I ain't gonna lie, I never really eat Wendy's burgers. Now you're gonna have to try their burgers. <laughs> burgers be healthy to you? Yeah, they be health, healthy. So they got real, like, meat. That McDonald's shit. Like, that McDonald's <laughs> shit, meat. I'm gonna tell you right hey, now. Stop talking about that. Hey, I know that shit's fake as fuck, dog. McDonald's, that shit, weak, bro. McDonald's, hey, weak as hell. That shit, they left a burger out for like a week. A, a son, <laughs> that shit ain't, ain't nothing happened to it. <laughs> <laughs> Where be certain videos I don't be wanting to watch. Like somebody keep trying to make me watch the video where how they make hot dogs, and I say no, bro, I'm not watching that shit because I like. Don't hot tell dogs. me how they make. Yeah, don't tell me. I'm not watching that shit, bro. No, no, no. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to know. I rather just you know enjoy my love, glizzy. Yeah, for real. But nah, hey, they have put out um. Now they put out, but I seen something about a video how they made the French fries for McDonald's. You don't want to see that because that when they bro, made the French fries, bro, and the chicken nugget. I don't want to see none of that. I definitely don't want to see that, that shit. That shit cardboard, brother. <laughs> but no, that motherfucker, the French fries, that shit got to sit out in like a like a um, field where they spray chemicals on it. It got to sit in the, like the potatoes got to sit in the field for like a couple of like a month or two. And it can't be moved. But look, this is the whole thing. Nobody could go out in the field. Because if you go out there, you could die from the chemicals. Yeah, see? <laughs> they got me <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> so like, well, hold on, wait. So, so what, what the fuck eat? y'all putting on these? What y'all putting in these shit? What the fuck y'all yeah. doing? Hey, bro, they had to experiment on this shit on us, bro. We experiments, bro. I think we, we really get these bro. I ain't going to lie. Yeah, bro. I think when shit be happening, they be like, hmm, okay, we see the effects of that. Okay, this work. Okay. They be writing shit down like, hmm. Oh, damn. Somebody died. This- okay. All right. Yeah. And he was they eating this. All it, this weird ass shit out here. And all this crazy ass shit. Hey, dog, I was watching this shit on Twitter too, right? The transgender, dog, this little ass transgender dude. I'm talking about not this big ass dude straight out. Like, he, he dressed up like a female. He like a, he like a female, like you feel me? And a big dude was fucking with him. I'm talking about that boy rock buddy ass, dropped his ass. I said, yeah, I got it. I remember now these transgender, they still men now. They cause they women. They cause they dressing up as yes, women. They grown ass man. <laughs> they still like they ain't they ain't not. A bitch. I know it look like I know it look, I know you might think that that's a bitch, but that ain't that's a goddamn man behind so that. Right. They can fuck around and shoot one of your hoes. <laughs> I'm playing. Hey, and that, hey, look, that's like when they were talking about some having them compete with the women. Or oh, they were thinking about letting them in the sports. Man, get nah, me. bro. Jawana man gonna be in basketball, stop putting up a fucking 40 nah, 40. You're gonna have somebody do that shit just to be funny, too, bro. Nah, bro. And how many weird niggas we got out here that'll do that shit just to be funny? A lot I'm of them. Saying. Somebody gonna try that shit. Be a transgender, just a motherfucking get in the women basketball and dominate that bitch. Take your dad out of that. Yeah, they crazy. We already got we already got D Wade talking about his daddy them raised him to. You seen that shit? The, the way all that nail polish. Nah, I don't, I don't. he said he been wearing his nail daddy, polish. Man, he lying. He wasn't wearing nail polish. Come on, man. D Wade. Now, if you been with doing that, okay. But we ain't. What we seen that at? You been at the heat for how long? We ain't see that. He started doing that Come after. On, Stop. Hey, he, he's just trying to, he's he just funny. D-Way funny. He's trying to convince people that, oh, yeah, this is just me and this and that. Bro, you wasn't doing that at the beginning of your career. Come on. Stop picking your nails, man. <laughs> I mean, you can't, I, I, you know what? I can't even say that because I be seeing certain dudes with their daughters. And when they, I ain't going to lie. I don't, I, I That's can't, different. I, I, I can't say, don't yeah, you see, if they with their daughters getting their nails done, then they'll get something on their <coughs> Listen, on, my daughter, like, my on daughter, middle nails. My daughter used to actually do my nails and shit. Like, I let her do the polish me way up here and shit. Like, that's different. I'm talking about actually going out and getting your nails painted, like a little manicure and all that. And, and you know what I'm saying? That shit. That little sexy shit. Like, 
to everybody to each his own. Everybody got their own, but I feel like I, I ain't with that. Hey, right. right, so you see, so you when you let's say any of your dogs, you got a dog in, you look at his finger and he got them shit like red and black. Face back red and black. What you say? I'm gonna ride that boy yeah, cause because I am just ride it. Like just me being me being honest, I'm gonna ride that boy yeah. I'm gonna probably call that boy Dennis Rodman and all type of shit. <laughs> But it's crazy. Like, bro, bro, just think like, that's on swag, like, dog. Imagine you come with your nails painted right now. Bro. Nah, but that, that ain't it. Mm-mm. That ain't it, bro. I'm like, bro, this swag. And I'm like, this swag. Nah, it's a lot more different type of swag out there than painting your damn nails. Look, look, look. I got on. Let's look. What I got on right now, and I got black and white. Black, white, black, white. I'm like, yeah, boy. You see this, boy? Swag. Mm-hmm. Ah. Oh, that's like nah, me that having green. And, and I put yeah, green to green. Green. Yeah. Oh. Hey, bro, we gotta come on. We gotta come. Fuck it. We gonna do it for the door. For for you gonna do it because for, for your daughters, you gonna let your daughter pay some nails, and I'm I'm let my girl pay my nails. How about that? We gonna show support to the fingernail painting motherfucker um, niggas who right. like they shit painted. How about I'm gonna, that? I'm gonna let you do it, and we gonna shout the boys out. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, you gonna leave me out there all no light? That that's crazy. I'm good. That's crazy, dog. <laughs> Damn man, but yeah, to move on, man. I seen a story with Bruno Mars. They say he owe um a, he owe a casino. Is it a casino? Yeah, he billion. in debt with the MG with the uh, MGM casino for fifty million. That's crazy. That's a crazy number. This Bruh. nigga was what was he doing? How how you know how you get in debt fifty? First Bruh. of all, how you get debt over M? That don't make sense to me. Bro, what was this man, bro? That's crazy, but like, the fuck? I mean, you go to the casino all the time. Ain't too much shit you could bet on. Bro. He, he wasn't playing a slot machine. He, he had to be, um, poker. Like, it, it ain't too much. Like, how, what you bet? I think that's over, like, that's they probably had him on a tab. That's probably, like, over some years. Bro, that mind. nigga got, he got a hell of a tab. <laughs> he got to have a leeway. His credit got to be A1 to get that type of uh, tab. No, where your dogs at? Where your dogs at to tell you, nah, bro, stop betting or some shit? Like, what? ain't nobody around you to tell you to stop betting, bro? 50 that million, probably, bro? That nigga, that nigga probably go by himself. Like two Super Bowls. That nigga go, that nigga go by himself. <laughs> that nigga need to do two Super Bowls and make that back. Hey, that nigga probably betting on the Hard Rock app, too, shit. <laughs> For free. And they just, they just racking it up. But nah, that's crazy though. Fifty million? Should I be going crazy right now? But you know he making money, so he'll be able to pay that back. Just, he making some money. Yeah. He'll be he'll be able to pay that back. You see, um, hey, boy, bro. Let's switch it up, right? You seen that boy? You seen that boy? Spot him, got him. You know the, the, the clo- He was in the closet or something. He was in like a, in the shed or something high. Shed with his dog. They had the Listen. dogs out. Yeah. Basically, they your hands or you will get bit by canine. This is canine. If I don't see your head, you will get bit. Hey, I see you, sir. You're wearing all black. We're not playing, sir. Ah. Ah. Oh. Come on. Come on. Your hands up. Move. Move. Move slowly. You will not get hurt, sir. If you move slowly. Wait. Wait, I got him, grab the dog. I got him. Don't reach for nothing. Wait. Eric, nice to meet you. He's going to go to you. Okay, Hold on, let me go. Hey, don't move. Don't move. Don't move. Hold on. Hold on. I got him. I got him. I got him. I got him. We're being safe. We're being safe. Come out slowly. You won't get bit, sir. Go to. Slow. Over here. Get on the ground right here. Get on the ground right here. I don't give a f about your leg. You can walk down here on the ground. Get the f on the ground. Yeah, you're going to slow had him on a high speed chase, right? Yeah. So, yeah, you feel me? So they 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 caught up to him. He ran. He hopped out of the car, bomb. He crashed. He hopped out of the car, bomb. He ran, and he ran to somebody in the backyard. And he hid in the shed behind a whole lot of shit. And the mm-hmm. police caught up to him. I guess he had not left the gun in the car, so he had a switch on that bitch and all. Like, yeah. So you know that's like that's fair time type shit. That's fair. So, yeah, they sent the dogs yeah, on on it. They done came out. They so got his ass. That shit, that crazy. Um, I what ain't gonna lie, man. Doing, dog? These rappers be tripping, dog. Why they all just get money and just stay out the way, bro? Why they be getting into all this shit, like? But I ain't gonna lie. Remember what stopped his bag too? He was um somebody said he was snitching. He was caught snitching on one of them tapes. 
Oh yeah, oh, 1090 J Cat done put that shit out too. Yeah, put that shit out. So that, that kind of fucked his. Yeah, remember little Dirk had then took his feature back. Oh yeah. Once he found out, yeah. No, I ain't he had that. a feature with Dirk at first. Dirk took his feature back because they found that shit out. Damn. Yeah, that shit. That shit stopped the little that shit him, black, yeah, that shit blackballed him a little black bit. Ball, yeah. The only person I see still going strong is Gunner. And um, what's the other dude from Florida? Google. Boston Richie? He had, yeah. Them the only two I see going strong that, that he had caught with snitching. I don't case. like fool. I ain't never like fool. Which one? Like Boston Richie. I don't like his music. Oh, you don't like? I thought you liked his music. Damn. Nah, I don't know. Uh, it's probably, it's, I probably do be bumping some of his songs. I don't even know that's him, but I don't. Yeah, I, don't we never, probably, I never, look, I never, I never in my life typed in Boston Richie and Boston put him like, I never did that, like ever. Nah, he got, he got some bangers though. I ain't gonna lie, Boston be fly, man. I kind of just, bro, it's crazy. The first song he came out, the first I, I heard him when Future hopped on that, um, and he said something about Sierra on um, Russell. What he said, fuck, oh fuck, Russell was. No, oh, that yeah, one, yeah, yeah. It was about. something about something about Sierra Russell Wilson though. But yeah, that that's when I first heard of Boston. But Boston be slide, bro. Shit, I kind of just got on fucking Gunner once his ass got out of fucking jail. Like I just started listening to his music. I, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Some I, of that shit I, I bet fuck with. I bet fuck with Gunner. Yeah, I wasn't never fucking with Gunner, but that shit, that some of that shit be sliding. I'm okay. Nah, that boy be sliding. I ain't gonna lie, like he got better by himself when when they, when he. St- when you snitch, like you got better. <laughs> You're stupid. He had to get better. For real, <laughs> that nigga got better. Hey, yeah, I fuck with Gunner, man. Gunner sliding on this couple. I think, songs, I think, man. I, I really think Thug them concocted that story just to, so when Gunner get out, just to get him out to make the money. Like you feel me? Cause I, I, I think so too. I'm telling you, I guarantee you, he the money. We still, man. We, we still don't know. Um, to keep the money coming in. We still don't know nothing about the like what he. How, like what yeah. he, um, what the paperwork is, or what he, like why he got out, like yeah, young thug like, daddy happened. came out and they were talking about some saying that, yeah, and then people coming shit. out saying yeah, he and y'all saying, just saying that y'all already it. made that story up, so we can leave Gunner alone. He can still make music, money can still come in, he can still support young thug and his family. I guarantee you he breaking bread, bro. Oh yeah, I know he breaking bread. He definitely. That was a smart thing to do if you ask me. Somebody got to be. Hey, hey, hey. This video old, though. You got to be thinking about Thug. How you, how you feel about that video when Thug girl came to that bitch? And she talking about something. What she said? What? Yes, daddy or some shit. You look beautiful. This shit don't look like a rapper now. This you want me to look like? <laughs> rapper. If I had to have a rap name, what would you pick it to be? I like that you called me Tiger Lily last night. Yeah. Yeah. Daddy, mm-hmm. I'm all your baby. That's what she said, and a lot of, <laughs> a lot of girls were laughing at her. That's how she said it. She said it like a little girl, like your daughter. I see that video when when he went to go visit and they leaked the video. Yeah, yeah. He said, "Hey, I'm your daddy." That nigga like, yeah. <laughs> hey, nigga, want to hear anything at that point? Shit. They go give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I'm behind these walls. Yeah, 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 baby. Yeah. I love you, uh-huh. baby. I love you, yeah. baby. I love you, baby. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We're going to get married when I come home. <laughs> 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 hey, that's another one I like, nigga. Then jail, tell something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to get married. Yeah, I'm going to get married. Nigga, I'm going to get married. 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 I'm going to get that that being like prison, prison when that shit. That time. being a real prison, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you know, in that in that yeah, that should be mostly like fucking crackheads and regular motherfuckers like me or people that got DUIs and shit like that. Oh, okay. Yeah, nobody ain't get to that level yet. They trying to change. Nobody, it yeah. <laughs> hey, when, when you when you get when you get them numbers, the real numbers, that's when you think about changing your life. That when you go to being Abdul Rahim and all that. <laughs> yeah. That's when you yeah, throw your whole yeah. name away. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm Abdul Rahim. <laughs> <laughs> like, brother, brother, I doing Raheem. That was the only ass. Fuck out of here. But yeah, no, nah, you would think me think about that shit. But no, nah, hey, and another. Remember we were talking about Jada Green and his baby mom. Um, his um, the girl got pregnant. His baby yeah. mama, I would say. Dre. Dre. How how they had that gap, that age difference. Yeah. How they talking about my boy Trayvon Diggs 
Cause he go with um the girl um Chloe. I think her name um Joey Ch- um Chavez. Joey Chavez, yeah. It, yeah, it's um Bow Wow and Future Baby Future. Mama. Just but look, Bow Wow and Future Baby Mama. <laughs> bro, I don't know why these dudes be <laughs> recycling these same females. Bruh. And I, bro, I just seen what that. I just seen that in the comments. They said, nigga, say, why y'all keep the same girl in rotation? Like y'all don't get. And there's so many baddies out there that look ba- better than them or the same. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. It can't be. What it is it, bro? Like, is that a part of the, of, of, of the little system shit that's that, going on? Yeah, the little what? system shit. I think they, they keep be them girls. Dog. Same girls are in that around them. I think it gotta get be. free everywhere them niggas going at. The girls get free tickets to the game, all type of shit, I think. They bro, be, they, somehow yeah. they just link up with these niggas. My girl to be it. somebody that nobody had never heard of, bro. Like, nigga, she put up type shit. Nigga, fuck you mean? I got too much bread. Yeah, too exactly. many hoes, same hoes. You just had a baby with this rapper. Then you had a baby with so, this ball player. So, so now you got her pregnant. And she got a baby with Bow Wow and Future already. Like, come on, man. That's like, hey, that's like me from my own neighborhood. And you talking to this girl. And, and she got, what's the name? Oh, yeah, remember what's the name? I said, dope around the corner. He got a baby <laughs> from her. And what's the name, boy? That boy finna get in the league. He got like, man, what the fuck? Boy, I ain't got time for all that, man. You got too many. Yeah, I can't. You got too it, much bro. shit going on, man. I don't know like, how they do it. Me. Y'all let's yeah, get I, that any female y'all want with all that bread and y'all picking these same old. Y'all like it. I love it, I guess. But not me. I couldn't do it. Hey, that's like going to the store and they got all these shirts and you see two niggas get this shirt and you say, damn, I know they got all these shirts, but I just seen two niggas pick up these. I seen a couple of niggas pick up these shirts. So let I'm going to get this shirt. Yeah, let me get this shit too because I see everybody pick up. Like, why you want the same shirt, nigga? <laughs> It's different shirts in here, man. I'm the type of nigga I don't want the same shit. I don't want to do the me. same shit niggas do. I want I want a different style. I want a different everything. I just don't want to be like everybody else. I'd rather be like me. Exactly. That, that's how I'm, I'm wired. That's one thing be I me. do, boy. I be me all day, boy. Anybody that know me, one thing about E, he gonna be himself. He gonna do what he want, wear what he want. You see all my shit back there, all my dolphin, my Pikachu, my love. Man, listen, I be myself, bro. They can't change me. At the end of the day, I'm happy with me, so that's a, that's, a, that's all. And that's the to. thing, bro. Niggas ain't happy. Well, people ain't happy with they sell. Um, people just be caught up in the social media shit. Now they see all these niggas doing all this extra shit. Like, bro, be yourself, man. Be you, nigga. I ain't, I'm happy, man. I'm happy with me. I got my my lady. She loved me for me. People, my family, you, everybody loved me for me. For I sure. love you for you. Like, bro. I ain't we ain't out here faking it because we be around people that's trying to be somebody else and we and we can't even kick it with them like that because we see that you, you living a false life like brother you not even like that why and you- I'm boy and listen boy I'm a good people reader boy I give me one to two minutes with the motherfucker talking with them and I can tell you exactly what type of person they is whether they're a good person bad person a person that be on bullshit a person that I'm hey, good that's at that crazy, shit bro. I can hey, read them like but that, but you, you don't think that's crazy that, how you can just energy, say that and that get that energy, energy? Boy. I'm good at That's that energy. Crazy. Yeah. Hey, so how, so look, you said as soon as you start talking to a nigga, let's say we you just talking to that I know what. How long you think it take you to like kind of sense? It take me like give me like give me like a good two minutes into the conversation and I can tell you, like I could t- I could kind of feel the person to tell you what kind of energy they give off. Like for real. I'm telling you, real shit. It always happened. I be reading bitches like that. Just like when I was. How many times up. you been wrong? Rarely none, bro. I swear. Bro, just like when I was locked up, bro. Like, I, I, that's why I, I've, I've um, met so many dudes that's cool as fuck, and, and I know how to stay away from the dudes that ain't. I can just feel their energy, and it's like, I know who to vibe with, and who not to vibe with, and who, like, be on some bullshit, and who always looking for trouble on some fuck shit. Like, I can feel that shit within two, three minutes of a conversation, bro. Like, and I know you. So I just. Like, hey, that's crazy. You know what? Because I get, I feel, I get it in a different way. Because when I, like, I read people on some. Just on silence. I only got to talk to him. I just be on some like you, you know. You can say one or two words and just see how a person movement. Yeah, yeah that's nah, what I'm saying. Yeah, nah, I ain't. Yeah, you know, like, this ain't this ain't my type of vibe. I can't even fuck with dude like that. You feel me? I'm telling you, like, some people just open their mouth and you know I'm real. Oh, nah, damn. <laughs> and that's like a you. girl. Like, back back in the day, like a girl that just opened her mouth, said some crazy shit. And you like, 
I ain't finna fuck with her like that. <laughs> like, like yeah, yeah right, I'm good off of you. Like, you on some wild shit. You said some dumb shit out your mouth. Like, yeah, bro. That's why, like, bro. That's why if I had a poll at my job and for anybody, like, bro, everybody at the job fuck with me, bro. Like, because my energy, I got good ass energy, bro. And I fuck with everybody. I don't go for who you is, how old you is, how young, like what color, what race, none of that. Like, I fuck with everybody. Like, but at the end of the day, bro. Why the fuck not? Why would I not like you? Why would I don't like, and I never, I don't even know you. Like, let me get to know a motherfucker first before you can stop not liking the motherfucker and all that shit. Like, that, and that's what be wrong with us. We, we judge, like, we judge people before we really know them. And sometimes them people be cool as fuck. You be thinking they are green and fuck nigga and all that shit, but then you meet them and talk to them, y'all vibe, you like, damn. Yeah. We got a lot in common, like, fool cool as fuck. Like, oh, she, she nice. She, you feel me? Like, sometimes you just gotta but, I, but, but you know what? It was a time that I did judge somebody, and I was, and I was wrong, but I was right. And let me tell you why I was wrong and right. So it was this person that I met, cool person, like straight person. When I, you know, I meet somebody, what's up? Was good. Start hanging out with the person. So by me hanging out with the person, I'm I'm going off of I don't, I'm really going off of somebody else that I know that know them that saying they cool. You feel me? And mm-hmm. we just want to fuck with each other, vibe it. Boom, boom. Hey, everything's straight. But it's like I get a little sense in my mind, like, God, something up. Like, you feel me? It's, it's something. Like, it's too, it's too, it's something up. Like, I got it's something up with him. So, whatever. We chilling. Boom. We, um, I think we, you know, we chilled a couple of, like, month for months now. We chilling. So, boom. One time we in the spot, we in the club, and fool just went left. Like, that boy on some. Hey, he like on some, yeah, boy. Nigga, you 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 been hey, you know me, you been this and that and the third. I'm like, yeah. You know, I'm looking like, hey, I'm looking like <laughs> the fuck? Like, like this, bro. Like, yo, the fuck? Like, yeah, nigga, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, I'm laughing at it, bro, because I'm cause I'm thinking like, yeah, you joking. You gotta be kidding me right now. Mm-hmm. So I'm laughing at it. I see it, this nigga dead serious. So that it was a whole altercation behind that, like. On some, I ain't gonna fuck with this nigga no more. You know, we almost got into it. So I said, mm-hmm. fuck that nigga, you feel me? Fuck that nigga. Yeah. He said, fuck me. Hey, whatever it is, what it is. We left it at that for like almost two, three months. Probably longer than that. And then later on, we wind up. I don't know how we linked up, bro. But it was just on some. I think we was in the club. And our mutual friend was in the. And he seen a nigga. Bro, and I done seen this nigga every play, places, bro. And I walk right past this dude and I say nothing to him after that day. Like, mm-hmm. Nigga, like he good, like he Casper and I'm Casper. We don't see each other. So he seen me one day. The nigga wind up just clapping a nigga up, bringing it again. Oh, boy, <laughs> man, 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 my bad, dog. You feel me? Like, I was tripping. You feel me? Like, apologizing. Like, so I'm just looking like, you know, my high. I'm looking like. Boy, that nigga was on the pill? They were drunk. Man, but I, I, I won't trust you. I, that's what I'm saying. I can't give you no. I can't still can't give you that because you're drunk. Yeah. Because drunk, they said drinking just the truth. the truth out. Yeah. Oh, I said. So when I'm drunk, bro, do I? Have a, I don't do shit crazy. Like exactly. When people get drunk, they people be more friendly than when they get drunk. Now you start saying some crazy shit, some personal that's shit. How you you get drunk. I feel like that's you how you really feel. Yeah. I feel like I that's how you him, feel, bro. nigga. I keep so, him out of this. Hey, one. I ain't gonna lie. Since that day, my eyes been on something like, yeah, it was good, but it ain't the same like it was before. You feel me? Like, I understand you apologize, but I just can't. You feel me? I ain't gonna lie. I rock with him, but it just ain't the same. You feel yeah, me? Man, so y'all, dog, y'all, be, like, y'all be careful who y'all, you know what I'm saying, who y'all make y'all friends and who y'all, you know what I'm saying? I ain't saying don't make no friends that don't be, you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying be careful. Because a lot of people be out some fuck shit. They know some fuck shit, for real. And some people be cool as fuck. You know, you gotta know how to separate the two, you feel me? Just be, you just focus on that energy and that energy will tell you all real. Trust me. It work good for me. Nah, for real. Nah, for real, like I said, focus on that. And don't be too caught up in having fun and thinking everybody you got that friend. Them be the motherfuckers who get fucked up. But everybody that think that's their friend, them people that just, oh, no, he's my friend. No, you know, everybody ain't your fucking friend, all right? God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> motherfuckers, everybody ain't your friend. You got motherfuckers that's here to get something out of you, use you, 
or just be around you because you popping or some shit at, for that moment. Mm -hmm. and everybody ain't your goddamn friend. Gotta no, sir. But they say keep your friends closer, keep your enemies closer. <laughs> hey, bro. And I, I like that because keep your enemies close so you can see what they, what the motherfuckers playing. The motherfuckers probably got something that they sleep. Exactly. So keep them right on close. You feel me? Keep them. Exactly. Keep them locked in. So we gonna, locked we gonna wrap it me, up bruh. right there, baby. We gonna wrap it up right there. One time, yes, NBL. You know what I'm saying? We appreciate hey. y'all sticking with us, hanging there with us. What you gotta say, bro? Hey, bro. This is my new, this is my new thing. Like right, when we close out, I'm gonna say, N B. Yeah, baby. I I done got I done came up with the I got it's I, all I got, love. I practice. <laughs> it's all love. One time, man. So we gonna close it out like this.